What's going on guys? Today we're going to be taking a look at the Zhiyun Smooth 3 smartphone gimbal. Real quick, let's go over the technical specifications for this device. The Smooth 3 is a super light system coming in at only 480 grams and in comparison to pounds, uh, this is a little under one pound so it's super light. The maximum payload of uh, what this thing can hold is 260 grams and in comparison to an iPhone 7 Plus that is only 188 grams, uh, you have the option there to add on some clip-on lenses and even the case depending on what a specific smartphone you're going to be using with this system. Zhiyun is claiming that this system can run for 14 hours straight and uh, a, a fun fact is I haven't charged this device since I've had it and I've had it for two solid weeks so I actually do really believe that this system can run for 14 straight hours. In terms of build quality of this system you can see right here uh, it's an all aluminum system uh, with the black overlay red accents and uh, in terms of just looking at this thing man it's amazing. Uh, the way it looks it looks very sleek all black red accents as i said before super lightweight uh has your joystick typical joystick right here your mode button power button rollies uh which directly correspond to using the application that this comes with and uh it's amazing man in terms of build quality this thing is solid it doesn't uh feel cheap at all and uh, i think this will last for a very long time the smooth three comes in at only 300 dollars and uh, what you get with this is this cool little carrying case that comes with the strap. Very protective, it's soft. Um, it's not like a leather, it's not like a hard case or anything, but it's very soft, it's, uh, it's fairly light. And I didn't think I would be using it this much, uh, but the fact that it comes with this strap, man, it's so easy to just throw over your shoulder, scoop it up when you're on a go, and just be gone, man. So uh, yeah, this comes packaged with the actual gimbal, the throw over tote, a charging cable, uh, that can also be used for updates on the computer and it comes in at only $300 US. This is a very simple system to use. So what you're gonna do when you get this uh, is you just put your phone in, you slide it, and uh, you just slide your phone to the edge. I already have my balance. I'm not gonna show you all how to balance it, but just know it's a fairly simple system. This is what this looks like, fully assembled. I'm gonna power this on and as you can see, the stabilization kicks in instantly. So you're able to use this in the typical landscape mode, which is what you'll probably use this for if you're planning on purchasing this device. Uh, but a cool feature about this is you're able to use this in portrait mode as well. So if you wanted to get like uh, cinematic Instagram or Snapchat stories for whatever reason, or just uh, get some cool looking live stream video with this, you can do this as well because it goes into uh, the portrait mode as well if you want to use it that way. The Smooth 3 can be used in a few different modes. This particular mode right here is full follow mode. So uh, if we pan left and right, as you can see, it's following me. And uh, if we want to go up and down, it'll follow me with the tilt as well. And uh, if you hit left and right on the joystick, you have full access to the roll as well. So roll is accessible with this device. If this is something that you're into, I shoot music videos and I think roll looks very good. So uh, the fact that this has it on is pretty great. So with the simple hit right here of the mode button, it'll take us to our next mode. And this mode right here is pan. As you can see, it's panning left and right with me, but if I go up and down, it will not follow me on the tilt axis. So if we hit that again, we'll have access to uh, locked off mode. It won't adjust with the pan or the tilt, but I have full access to uh, pan and tilt with the joystick. So if we want to pan, we can just hit the joystick and go left to right. And uh, we can also go up and down to adjust the tilt. So these are the different modes that are accessible with this particular device. The Smooth 3 is fully functional with the Zion Play application. On the body of the Smooth 3, you can see it has a rolly right here. And it also has a settings button right here. And these are both relative to using the application. Inside the application, I'm not going to show you all it. You have the option to manually adjust your shutter, ISO, aperture, all of those things, all of those pro features that get you away from using auto exposure when filming this. So you have pro features inside of it, but you also have the option to manually adjust your motor settings. Say you wanted this to pan slower, pan faster, you have the option as well inside of this application. So it's a pretty cool app. It makes it so you don't have to plug the device into a computer to adjust your motor settings or even have to pay for another application inside the app store that will give you access to uh, manually adjusting your exposure settings on your smartphone. Over the past two weeks, my use with this particular device has primarily been vlogging. Y'all know me, y'all know I vlog, so uh, this is a great option for me. Sometimes I want to be discreet in these places. When I'm out, I don't want to bring a huge camera with me with a microphone on top of it. So that is a reason why I love this thing. Another thing that I really like about this with vlogging is I have my front camera on 
my phone, I can see myself, my shots are smooth. So it's just an all around plus in terms of vlogging for me. Other than vlogging, I actually did take the opportunity out and test this, shooting an entire music video. I shoot music videos as well. I wanted to see if this was a viable option too shoot music videos on for the people who don't necessarily have the budget to purchase a big camera. I actually shot a pretty cool music video in my personal opinion. I'm gonna put a few clips from the music video right here for you all to check out, but if you wanna see the entire music video, just click this info card right here. Chosen one to go to chat, it's only me. I always thought I'd have all my homies with me. Shit, I always thought I'd have all this money to blow. It ain't your time yet, just know your time is coming. No, hey, in the meantime, in between time. Boy, you ain't got no time to waste, you better get up and grind. As you can see, this thing performed pretty well. Like, the in-body image stabilization of the phone combined with this gimbal made the shot super smooth. And a lot of these smartphones nowadays have 4K. I was able to shoot 120 frames per second on my iPhone. Like that's crazy to me. Like, so this thing is actually a viable option for music videos for the people who can't necessarily afford a bigger camera. My overall thoughts on this device is, it's great, it's amazing for what it is, and I think it does its job pretty well for what it's supposed to do. This is gonna be for the people who wanna get into vlogging, they don't really wanna spend a lot of money on vlogging, but they want a slight quality bump, they want their stuff to look a little bit better. This is gonna be for those people, and this is also gonna be for the people who don't necessarily have the budget to purchase a bigger camera, but they wanna get smooth, professional looking shots off of their phone. And as I said, man, a lot of these phones do 4K, they have different frame rate options, so this is actually a pretty good viable option for the people who are out there. Uh, looking for something to bump up their music video quality or just projects or whatever like i feel like this is a really good option for what it is i'll leave a link down in the description for you all to check this product out if you're interested in it drop me a like if you enjoyed this video also if there's a topic or something that i didn't touch on with this device that you want answers to just drop your question down in the comments i'll make sure to get to it answer you all i'm gonna check out a lot on my next video though peace